public institutions will now be required to record financial transactions regardless of when the actual cash, cash flow for the transaction are received. The transaction form of the current cash accounting system when auditing public service entities has been necessitated by the increasing amount of uncounted funds during the year financial reviews. The system change will be done in phases from the 1st of July in 2023 and will take three years for a full transition. According to Section 159 of the Kenyan Companies Act, all companies need to appoint an auditor annually. For public service institutions, external auditing is conducted beside it to ensure public funds are accounted for to the last cent. The Public Sector Accounting Standards Board, however, now says the large number of gaps witnessed in accounting for funds allotted to their offices stems from poor bookkeeping and periodic cash accounting systems. To solve this, the Public Sector Accounting and Standards Board has imposed the use of accrual accounting systems for all public offices to ensure better accountability and monitoring of these funds. So setting the financial accounting and internal auditing standards, uh, including the formats for presentation and disclosure of both financial and non-financial information ensures uniformity in reporting by state organs and public entities. We do not want to wait for an annual event. We are looking, uh, we are looking at a continuous engagement with our uh, reporting entities. Auditor General Nancy Gadungu says government institutions must strive to hire professionals as internal auditors to weed out inefficiencies at the root before an external audit is conducted. She says the stipulated standards will be adopted by public offices and compliance will be mandatory. That ultimately these efforts will aid in establishing sound financial reporting and governance practices in public sector in Kenya. PSABS now says counties have to be prepared with effective asset management and monitoring and evaluation before the system is implemented. This might help in changing the situation where we have seen a lot of auditing gaps, especially in public service entities. Hibak Said for Prime Edition.